Hi guys, this NDA passed questions and answers. For those of us who is to blame for NDA exam, okay? Make sure you like the video, subscribe so that you get more of it. This is Chemistry 2004 questions and answers. Okay, now let's get started. Question number one. The formula for CH2O for ethanol acids is regarded as it dash A, a perical formula, B, molecular formula, C, structural formula, and the general formula. So what is the best answer? Well, the best option for the answer is option A, that's a perical formula. The formula for CH2O for ethanol acid is regarded as it a perical formula, that's option A. Thank you. You are right. Now, the next question. Which of the following gases contain the least number of atoms as STP? Option A, 7 modes of argon, B, 4 modes of chlorine, C, 3 modes of ozone, D, 1 mode of um, butane. So, which of these options is right? Well, I think the right answer here is option D, 4 modes of argon, 3 modes of butane. Number of the 10 has one carbon atom and four hydrogen attached to it. So option three is the right answer. Thank you. Okay, you are right. Now the next question. The chromatic separation of A is based on the ability of the component to do what? Okay. Option A dissolve in each other of the column. Option B move at a different speech in the column. Option C, we add with the solvent. Option D, we add with each other. Okay, which option here is the best answer for it? Go ahead, I think the right answer here is option B, move at a different speech in the column. That is to say that the group will the separation of A is based on the ability of the company to move at a different direction in the speech. Okay, now let's move forward to the next question. A compound contains 31.91 percentage potassium, 28.93 percentage chlorine, and the rest of them are oxygen. What is the chemical formula of the compound? Remember that the um, potassium has the mass number of 39, and chlorine has approximately the mass number of um, 36 and oxygen has the mass number of 16 so which option here is the best option for it option a potassium ozochlorine option b potassium diozochlorine option c potassium triozochlorine and option d potassium tetraozochlorine so which of these is the answer well i think the right answer here is option c Potassium to the ozochlorine is the right answer. Hello guys, um, this question has been tested and trusted, okay? Um, it's especially made for you, okay? For those of us who have the dream to study in NDA, okay? Um, if you have any challenges or you have any misunderstanding, you can comment. You can comment so I can get back to you all. If you want the question in um, PDF format or if you want the soft copy of the past question of this compendium NDA past question and answer, you can also comment or you call this number 081-44-00-1683. Then I will tell you what to do. Okay? Be more at home. Study the past question one by one. If you have any challenge, you can comment so that I can get back to you. Thank you. Now, let's move forward to the next question. A little quantity of 3-chloromethene as a boiling point of 60 degrees centigrade was added to a large quantity of ethanol as a boiling point of 78 degrees centigrade. The most probably boiling point of the resultant mixture is from what to what? Option A. 60 degrees century to 78 degrees century, 69 to 70 degrees century, 
degrees century, 82 to 84 degrees century. So what is the answer? Well, I think the answer here is option D. That is 82 degrees century to 84 degrees century. That is to say option D is the right answer. You are right. The answer is option D, 82 to 84 degrees century. Now let's look at the next question. The gas that gives brown coronation in brown red taste is known to be what? Option A, carbon oxide. Option B, nitrogen oxide. Option C, carbon dioxide. Option D, nitrogen dioxide. So what is the best answer for it? Well, I think the answer here is option B, nitrogen oxide. Okay, now let's look at the next question. Which of the following give precipitate when treated with sodium hydroxide solution? Option A, ammonium chloride. Option B, sodium carbonate. Option C, aluminium trichloride. Option D, ethanol acid. So, what is the answer for it? Option B is the right answer. That is, um, sodium carbonate is the answer for it. You are right. Now, let's look at the next question. The reaction of arcane with hydrogen in the presence of a catalyst is known to be what? Option A. A nucleophilic reaction. Option B. Amadition reaction. Option C. A substitution reaction. Option D. Oxidative reaction. Okay, which of these uh, reaction is the right answer for it? Well, I think the right answer for it is option B. Amadition reaction. That is to say that the reaction of amarcane with hydrogen in the presence of a catalyst is known to be amadition reaction. You are right. Option B is the right answer. Now let's move forward to the next question. The intermediate product form when ethanol is progressively oxidized to ethanol and with potassium heptal ozone dichromate 4 is called what? A. Methanine B. Propanine C. Ethanine D. Butanine So which of these options is the right answer? Well, I think the intermediate product form when ethanol is progressively oxidized to ethanol and with potassium heptal also dichromate 4 is called um, ethanol. That is option C is the right answer. You are right. C is the right answer. Okay, now let's um, move over to the next um, question. Okay. The compound above is is what is called what? Um, option A, primary alkanon. Option B, secondary alkanon. Option C, tertiary alkanon. Option D, glucose. Which of these options is the best answer for it? Well, I think the right answer is option D, secondary alkanon. Well, I believe you enjoy yourself, okay, um, with this um, past question and answer. This is just part one. Okay, if you need the past, but the part two, go to my YouTube channel and search for it. You'll see it, okay? And don't forget um, to subscribe to my YouTube channel so that you'll be getting more of these um, questions, okay? If you have any challenge, you can also um, comment, like the video. Thank you.